<laughs> Welcome back, Dashum family! How are you guys doing today? This is a vlog, a daily vlog at that. It is Monday! Monday! I believe it is February 5th? Six. Or is it the 6th? It's the 6th. Today is February 6th. It's a Monday. And guys, we're just gonna get into this crap today. You guys are gonna be watching us today. And yeah. Let's go! Let's do it! I wanted to show you all the medications I take on a daily basis. The only one I don't take daily is this one. This one is my cabergoline. This one's actually the medication that shrinks my pituitary tumor because it's a prolactinoma. So this combats that to shrink the tumor. I take this one three days a week, which is Mondays, Wednesdays, and Fridays. And since today's Monday, I have to take that one. Uh, this pill right here is for, um, I think that one's the... Um, my thyroid is the is that blue one, and this other white one is actually a estrogen uh, blocker. Only because the pituitary tumor I had um, really rose the levels of estrogen, it decreased my testosterone and everything like that. So it's I take, actually a cancer medication that women take whenever they have breast cancer. Oh yeah, to that's help right. lower their level or something like that. And so it's actually helping Gabe lower his levels as well. Yep. So I take those three, just this one three times a week, but I take these two daily. So I'm going to go ahead and take that one. I try to take them when I get up in the morning, you know, when, right before breakfast, I go ahead and take these three medications and yeah, Drew keeps me on point taking them every single day. <laughs> yes. I make the bacon in the microwave. Gabe likes his a little bit more crispier. So we're going to do another Crisper. two minutes. Crisper. Rainy days don't seem so wet Stormy nights don't stay From the moment that we met You're worth the wait Oh, this could be the best thing that I'll ever know Talk for hours and never slept. This is literally a typical morning in the live. Gabe is on the phone with his doctors, doing all that kind of stuff. If you have someone in your life that is dealing with an illness, then you totally understand. You're always on the phone with insurance. You're always on the phone with the doctors. You're always trying to get your medications refilled and things like that. Um, so we go ahead and make breakfast. And then now I kind of get on my computer and work, answer some emails, answer comments on TikTok and Facebook and stuff like that. Right now, I'm currently shadow banned on TikTok, it feels like. I posted a video like an hour ago and it had like only like 800 views and I was like, what the actual heck? Um, but it's okay. It's it's all right. TikTok don't like us. TikTok doesn't like, honestly, TikTok don't like anybody. Um, but I'm just going to go ahead and check some things. I like to answer back to you guys when you email me or DM me. Um, just checking on Cincy. Right now, Cincy has a really big sale. If you guys are interested, I'll link it down below. Also have a mug coffee. Um, but I can show you guys the Cincy sale really quickly. So currently, Cincy is doing a last chance. Don't miss out on these products because every single one of these products is leaving March the 1st. So we have a really good sale going on right now with a bunch of our normal scents, some of our um, winter scents. A lot of stuff is selling out because it is just such a good price and an amazing deal. I will link it down below for you guys. It is honestly the best deals 
ever. Okay, friends, we actually decided to leave the house today. We were gonna stay home and do a bunch of working stuff, but we decided to leave the house today and do a little bit of fun stuff for you guys. So we are currently at the gas station and Gabe went in to get us a quick little drink and then we're getting gas and then we're gonna go to a brand new Sheffield and Sheffield. If you did not know, it's like my newest obsession is going to these liquidation stores. And so we're gonna go to, this lady's staring at me. We're gonna go to this new Sheffield and Sheffield and we're gonna bring you guys along with us. It's gonna be a great day. I cannot believe we're stopped by a train. We're stopped by a train. It's about to eat a can of Vienna sausages in the stinking truck. I always drain my juice out first, always. Usually I run water in them afterwards. I pour. Oh no! no! Go get them. My sausages, man. I think they're still good. No, they're good. I'm gonna eat these bad boys anyway. Oh my. <laughs> oh man, my little wiener hit the top and shredded himself. Oh my goodness. So look, what I usually do, and I'll probably do a little, this is the way to eat Viennas. You get some of that sodium out of there by, by washing that out. And also, I always used to pour a little bit of water in you there. used to, you eat these things every day. Okay, yeah, you're right. I pour water in them like that, and I kind of swish it around, and then I pour the water out. And that gets a lot of that extra sodium stuff out of there. And that's, some of them, some depending on the brand, has like a slimy on, on them, but you put a little water on them and rinse them off. And them bad boys are just delectable. Uh uh. That ain't, that's a no from me, dog. Guys, honestly. Ew! The brand I like is not actually Armor. I like Libby's, but the gas station only had the Armor brand. So these ones are a little more salty tasting, but. Oh no, mm, man. Still good. We just left out of there. They didn't have a lot of great stuff, I guess, because it's new. So they're still trying to unpack and do all that. So we'll wait a little while before we come back to this location of Sheffield. Um, but I think my favorite so far has definitely been Treasures for Less. Treasures for Less. Treasures for Less is like 10 out of 10. They have more, I think they have like more high quality stuff. More of like name brand, not just Target and Walmart right. mishaps. I right. think a lot of Sheffields have more unboxed items on the tables, but Treasures for Less is more in the box, high quality items. Like good that, stuff. Like, you know what I'm saying? Not like you can tell it's been moved around. It's like actual like in the box good stuff, stuff yeah. yeah and they got like like they had like stuff like blackstone grills in boxes but there's and like wrong all kinds with of stuff. The stuff out of the box at all I give no. you guys nothing wrong i'm saying like you can tell some of the stuff has like stains on it you know, right. has, like, black on it things like that from just being out of the box type things so. right like i got banged around but yeah. um anyway so we're gonna leave here we're gonna go find somewhere else to go and yeah keep watching Okay, change of plans. We just got done with lunch and then I grabbed a little Starbucks because I'm gonna be on the way to go with my friend Ashley. You guys know her on TikTok. I'll put her TikTok handle up here if you guys wanna go follow her journey. She's in nursing school currently. She just moved out on her own. She has roommates, but on her own without her parents. Um, and you need to buckle up. Oh yeah, I do need to buckle up. We just um, pulled out of a drive-thru. We just pulled the drive-thru. We usually have to unbuckle to get the whatever. Anyways, so, and he is buckling up by the way. Um, but so Gabe to go drop me off and I'm gonna go ride with her to the grocery store because nobody wants to go to the grocery store buy them stinking self and so he's gonna drop me off and go do his little thing and i'm gonna go with ashley to go to the grocery store um help her get her groceries and then we're gonna go to the pet supplies plus store because where she lives is about 30 minutes away from me now and they have a huge pet store and she said it's way better than the one we have here and so i'm gonna go with her to do that and then hang out with my girly girl and then we're gonna head back home to see the doodles Ooh, that sugar sweet you got what i need Sipping on the potion, all that good emotion, just my kind of heat. Keep it on repeat. Tested by the potion, loving this to potion.
a ton of groceries for her and she's such a good little shopper budgeter like we love we just stinking great value here, okay? i buy great value too and i still end up paying 300 dollars someone explain that to me Okay, so my camera died in the middle of Walmart, so I don't even know what I filmed. I filmed some stuff on my phone, but let me flip the camera around and show you guys what I'm cooking for dinner. So I have some ground beef, and I didn't want spaghetti, and we didn't have the right spaghetti noodles, so I'm going to make some minestrone pasta, but less juice and more thickness because Gabe said he doesn't like soup unless he's sick. So I'm going to go ahead and throw some onion and carrots into the pot. Let me set the camera down. Maybe y'all can see us. I don't know. Go ahead and put this into our big old pot. And then let me get a tripod so I can set y'all up. I added a little bit of butter into the pan because I don't have any more of the oil that I like. And it's half, well, it's actually a whole little small white onion and some carrots. And we're gonna go ahead and sweat these down. And then I'm gonna add in some ground beef, beef broth, some pilled tomatoes. Usually I'd rather do some like Italian style, but I ran out of Italian style. Some kidney beans, some of this pasta, and we're gonna season the stinking heck out of it. And the doodles are playing, making a lot of noise, so I apologize. Okay, so I've been letting everything cook, and I'm going to show you guys. I don't want the screen to get all um, foggied up from the cooking, but I am making kind of like a minestrone soup, but more meaty and less um, pasta. Just that way we get some more protein with the beans and the meat, and not so much the noodles, which even though the noodles are my favorite part, Gabe prefers it to be more thick. He asked for a soup, not soup. So I'm waiting for the noodles to be cooked, and then we'll be able to plate it with some cheese, some... Um, well, I guess you don't put sour cream in this. It's not like it's chili. But yeah, it's gonna be delicious. time for nightly diet coke take my makeup off have on one of my husband's big old t-shirts and i'm just sitting in the office watching some youtube videos i'm about to edit today's vlog um i'm also washing clothes if you can hear that from the laundry room but i hope you guys enjoyed this vlog today i'm exhausted i have a massive headache so yesterday bruiser i don't know if you guys can tell you can kind of see it kind of see like the shadow but right here bruiser like i was bending down and he was jumping up and i didn't see him there and so he jumped into my head and me and him hit heads so hard like his top of his head hit the top of my head and it has been the worst headache for the last like day um oh look who just joined me hi mumu bye mumu bye lucy um, but anyways, I have a really bad headache, and you guys can kind of see it's like a knot right here, and it just stank and hurts. Oh, look, they're brooder bear. Um, but yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed today's vlog. We'll see you guys tomorrow, and love y'all.